everyone welcome to ecoholics in this video we'll be discussing what is median and we'll also be studying how to calculate median in case of individual observation so what is median median of a given set of observation is the middlemost value from that set of observation so median basically means the middlemost value Now, so median divides the whole series into two equal parts, where one part is greater than the median value and other part is smaller than the median value. Now, now let's take an example to understand the concept of median. So. we have given set of observation as so a given set of observation let's say we have 1 2 3 4 and 5 now by looking at the series uh, we can see that 3 is our middlemost value and median is nothing but it is the middlemost value by just looking at the series we can say that 3 becomes a median and we have already seen that median divides the series into two equal parts so we have this part which is less than 3 and we have this part which is greater than 3 and therefore 3 becomes a median because it divides the series into two equal parts one part being less than the median value and other part being greater than the median value now every time by looking at the series we cannot find median and therefore we have two different formulas for calculating median first when n that is number of observation is odd and second when number of observation is even so when n is odd a formula for median is a uh, median is equal to n plus 1 by 2th term and when n is even a median value is n by 2th term plus n by 2 plus 1th term divided by 2 so we basically take the arithmetic mean when n is even right so now uh, let's look at this example from the following data of the wages of seven workers compute the median wage and we have wages in rupees now how do we calculate median the first step for calculating median is we arrange the data either in ascending order or descending order so first we'll arrange this uh, wages either in ascending or descending order so let's first arrange wages in ascending order you can also arrange it in descending order so first we have Fourteen thousand one hundred. Second, we have fourteen thousand one hundred fifty. Third, third, we have fifteen thousand two hundred. Fourth, we have sixteen thousand eighty. Fifth, we have sixteen thousand one sixty. Then we have seventeen thousand one hundred twenty. Then we have 
have lastly 17,400. Now, the second step is to find how many number of observations do we have. So, in this case, N So, N N in this case is 7 and 7 is odd number. And from this, we can see that when n is odd, our formula for median is this. So, median is equal to size of n plus 1 by 2th term. So, this means that median is size of n plus 1th term that is 7 plus 1 divided by 2. So, median is basically size of 8 by 2th term. And this is nothing but size of fourth term. And after arranging our wages in ascending order, our fourth term is this. Since our fourth term is 16,080, so our median wage becomes equal to 16,080. This is our median value and we have three persons who have wages less than 16,080 and we have three persons who have wages greater than 16,080. So, in this case, this is our median value. Now, let's look at another example. Obtain the value of median from the following data of the monthly income of 10 employees of a company and this is given in rupees. So, we have monthly income of 10 employees. Now, how do we calculate median in this case? So, first we arrange the data either in ascending or descending order. So, we are going to arrange We are going to arrange income of 10 employees in ascending order. So, we have income in ascending order. <coughs> so, first we have the least income is 14,391. Second, we have 15,384. Third, then we have 15,407. Then we have 16,672. Then we have 16,777. Then we have 25,591. Next, we have twenty six thousand 
522. Next, we have 26,753. Then we have 27,850. And lastly, we have 37,490. Then, then our second step is to determine if a number of observation is even or odd. So, in this case, n is equal to 10, which is even. So, the formula for calculating median when n is even is n by 2th term plus n by 2 plus 1th term divided by 2. So, using this formula, what we get is median is equal to size of n by 2th term plus n by 2 plus 1th term divided by 2. So we have n by 2 that is 10 by 2 we have 5th term plus n by 2 that is 10 by 2 plus 1 that is 5 plus 1 that is 6th term divided by 2. So our fifth term is 16,777 and our sixth term is 25,591. So, we are going to add these terms. So, we have 16,777 plus 25,591 divided by 2. This is equal to 42,368 divided by 2. And this gives us 21,184. So, in this case, a median is equal to 21,184. So, median is equal to 21,184. And this is nothing but a median income for this example. That's it for this video. For more such videos, do like and subscribe our channel. Thank you.